Hey everyone, welcome back to another new exciting video. Hope that you caught the good news of releasing Gemini 3 Pro. Here you see official notification introducing Gemini 3 Pro, the world's most intelligent model that can help you bring anything to your life. And I have tested this model inside this Google AI Studio. And also I have tested this inside LM Arena Web Dev and I got the different kind of outputs. And also I have compared the output with the Claude Sonnet 4.5 and also Gemini 2.5 Pro. And I have compared it. And in this video, I will show you the detail analysis that how much improvement is there inside Gemini 3 Pro. So let's start it. So first of all, go to this uh, Google AI Studio and after that here you will find this model Gemini 3 Pro and uh, currently it is in the preview mode and if you see the pricing here you see that its pricing is less than 200k token. It is $2 for the input and uh, output is it is $12 and greater than 200k it is $4 and output is $18 which is very less than the clot Here you see in case of clot on 4.5 it is $3 and $6 whereas Google is charging $2 and $4 so it is less than clot but the interesting thing is that the benchmark that they have published it is actually showing that it is beating the uh, clot on 4.5 and GPT 5.1 also Here you see that on this HLE uh, benchmark which is the very the toughest exam on this benchmark it is uh, scoring more than the Gemini 2.5 Pro and also it is beating Claude Sonnet 4.5 on a various uh, gr a great accuracy level okay and here you see on all of these benchmarks that they have given it is beating the other models and uh, if I show you the output that I have got from this uh, Gemini 3 Pro here you see I have just asked it to build a travel booking website and after that I got this kind of output if I just uh, show you in a large screen so where is that large screen output yes this one this one is from the Gemini 3 Pro and if I show you the same prompt that I have given to Gemini 2.5 Pro and this is the output so here you see this is the output now in case of Gemini 2.5 Pro here you see that the background image is not uh, that much attractive and also it is taking the half portion of the screen and also there is no uh, great footer and also the screen is not that much attractive in case of Gemini 2.5 Pro this is Gemini 2.5 Pro now if I show you the output from the Gemini 3.0 Pro here you see that the output is actually uh, very amazing and production ready and also the background the hero section is looking modern and beautiful and there is a different different tabs and also there is a uh, good uh, middle section okay so it is clearly visible that there is a good and huge improvement uh, they have done in this Gemini 3.0 uh, Pro and what I have tested inside uh, LM Arena here you see that this is these are the output and this is a skeleton uh, double helix okay this is a double helix skeleton and here you see that uh, you can change it okay you can change the length and you can change the twist also and spin speed okay so this is good right and also <clears throat> there is a bridge view uh, here you see this is a bridge view golden bridge view and you can change the density of the traffic and you can uh, change the fog density here you see this is a fog density so this is working fine right and the output here you see the image quality is very good and uh, also when I compare the same thing with the Claude Sonnet 4.5 here you see this is also travel uh, design booking website okay travel booking website here you see if you compare these things with the Gemini 2.5 Pro sorry Gemini 3.0 Pro this is Gemini 3.0 Pro and this is Claude Sonnet 4.5 you tell me which one is best so for me at least I will definitely go with this Gemini 3.0 Pro because they have placed this uh, search bar these things these things at the center of this hero section and there is a great um, hero section title and all of that things okay but here you see in case of Claude Sonnet 4.5 this is not that attractive and it is, it is not that much professional right so there is a 
clear improvement uh, in design in case of uh, Gemini 3.0 Pro. You also please test it out. It is completely currently free uh, inside this Google AI Studio. But if you are using it through API, then remember that you the charge is this much. Okay. Also, they have written this training data set. Uh, Gemini 3 Pro is trained using reinforcement learning techniques that can leverage multi-step reasoning, problem solving, and theorem provided data. And they have just uh, used the publicly available web document, text, quote, and images, and audio. Okay, and video. And by the way, if you in inside this Google AI Studio also, uh, you can use this um, these apps that are available to integrate with the uh, Gemini 3.0 Pro. So you can build the AI apps also. This was also I have discussed previously in my other previous video. Okay. So this is the things guys. Mm -hmm. I hope that you got the knowledge from this video that why this Gemini 3.0 Pro is so much beautiful and attractive. And if you have any thought, if you have tested it inside uh, cursor with the help of API or inside VS Code with the help of API, then please let me know. I will make a separate video with the help of API because I have not tested it in a short span of time um, through API. So maybe tomorrow or day after tomorrow, I will publish another video uh, that what type kind of output we are getting if we use it through api and how much cost it takes the token count all other things i will reveal in my another next video okay so if you found a detailed analysis video from this uh, analysis explanation uh, please make sure to subscribe this channel and please like this video share this video with your friends see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye bye take care